but I'm really happy to release this book, Rising to the Call, Good Practices of Climate Change Adaptation in India. This is exactly the time when we wanted it badly. And you have done it. And as you said, there may be hundreds of good practices in India, but you have mapped only 20 of them as an example, as a beginning. And I want you to go more. We can also help for that. 100 crores, that's just the beginning. 100 crores are marked for the separate adaptation fund, climate adaptation fund. And I've asked my uh, officers immediately that prepare the plan. But now I will tell them that this is people are already doing. But what we are mapping, we have to come up with helping all those adaptation plans, which are already practiced by the people, because people have tremendous capacity in India to adapt. Any new technology, farmers adapt. सबसे फास्ट फार्मर है जिसको आप अनपढ़ समझते हो वो सबसे ज्यादा पढ़ा लिखा है ऐसा मेरा मानना है बिकॉज दे आर उनके पाव जमीन पर है और वो करते रहते हैं सो दैट सॉ वी ग्रो एंड दैट सॉ वी शुड अडेप्ट दीज अडेप्टिव स्किल्स शुड हैव बिन मैप्ड एंड आई एम वेरी हैप्पी चंद्रभूषण एज डन दिस दूसरी बड़ी बात हमने की है और जो इंपॉर्टेंट है बिसाइड दिस एडेप्टेशन प्लान fund because we want to really develop this adaptation capacity which is very important because this vagaries of monsoon as we used to say is now not only vagaries of monsoon it is all climate zones all climate conditions and you are getting it so somebody referred to chandrabhushan referred to that some people say that is western western conspiracy i never say anything as conspiracy Whatever science is telling us is real and if it is imperfect, it will become perfect and if it is not there, then we will be happy. But today what we are experiencing is important. And that experience is that I was in my head, which I was in my head, it was not happening in my head. So if my head is in my head, then I must clean my hair. I was drinking water in my house. Today I can't drink water in my house. If that is the condition, I must clean my hair. If that is the condition, I must purify my water. वो अगर हरियाणा और उत्तर प्रदेश, पश्चिमी उत्तर प्रदेश में सब जगह अगर वो खेत जला रहे हैं और उससे अगर स्मॉग हो रहा है और फिर सुनीता नारायण मशीन लेके जज के पास जाती है तो then मैं आपके पास पे आऊँगी लेकिन उसकी पब्लिसिटी नहीं करूँगी तो मैं लूँगा तो what I am saying is see these are real problems and so one has to take note of what is happening. But I just wrote, she was seeing what I'm writing. But uh, I had read an article in Marathi newspaper where the scientist has mapped vagaries of monsoon in Marathwada region of Maharashtra of 100 years because we had that done. So this happens. This is not that this has started happening since 1980. That also will let us be clear. This has happened. If you see the 100 years window, 1000 years window, 10,000 years window, you get different pictures. But still we are suffering and therefore we must act. We must act on our own. And that is the commitment of the government. That we will take our own actions on our own conviction and with our own commitments, without anybody's dictation, in a mission mode without permission of course <laughs> and we will do that because because we value human life we cherish idea of India and we want people to have a good life and therefore there was a CAG report when we talk of CAG report we always talk of CA 2G <laughs> CWG coal <laughs> But that's not all. CAG does many good things. Besides these three reports, they have come out with a very good report on water pollution in India. And the status of water pollution is this, that one-third of the, one-fourth of the industrial pollution today goes untreated in the water bodies. One-half of the domestic waste ultimately finds its place in water bodies. And more shockingly, two-thirds of the agricultural waste 
first when I read, I was not knowing this word at all, anything so basic. But then I realized that if you are a diabetes or if you want to give some antibiotic, they give you 5 milligram, 10 milligram, and they can inject you directly into the patient's body, so he is treated. But in you don't give injection to every plant, so you just throw. Something is used, and many things are not used. So pesticide or fertilizers, they are go, go down deep into the uh, percolate down and find out ultimately to the water streams, and that has polluted the water. So be it the industrial waste, be it the domestic waste, be it the uh, agricultural waste, today fact remains that our water is contaminated. So pehle ye gana tha. कि गंगा मैली हो गई पापियों के पाप धोते धोते लेकिन वो नहीं है गंगा मैली हो गई इन तीन कारणों से इंडस्ट्रियल पोल्यूशन एग्रीकल्चर वेस्ट है डोमेस्टिक वेस्ट सो इफ दैट इज द कंडीशन वी मस्ट एक्ट ऑन आवर ओन और क्लाइमेट चेंज का अगर कार्बन एमिशन अभी मैं मुझे थोड़ा लेट जो हुआ दैट वॉज बिकॉज आई वॉज टेकिंग ए प्रेजेंटेशन फ्रॉम यंग साइंटिस्ट एन इंडियन was patented in 150 countries now that he has developed a four chamber something which will be fitted before the chimney in thermal power plants and so pollution coming CO2 is absorbed with biological and chemical methods it is recycled becomes slurry then becomes briquette goes back to the coal chamber and then in the third chamber, it takes away the, you know, you know to, so to, I'm not a science student, but those sare gases jo zehrile hai, jo pollution kari hai, nikal ne ka ek tantra, bhaartiya vaigya niko ne sabit kiya hai, aur ye abhi lab success hua hai, ab wo field ne aana hai. That's a good beginning. That's a good news. Chandra Mushan ke baasha mein, what is good news? Is this. Mayne abhi Lima mein gaya tha, mayne dunia ko bata hai. Dekho, we want technology and technology without IPR cost. They will say, how would say it's a private thing, it's a IPR. I said, you did it for HIV AIDS. <coughs> oh, that's a different area. What different area is it? We will innovate and we will make an India. We will. But this is not the case of all these developed countries and island countries who are really vulnerable. And so we want to help them also. Chandrabhushan has seen what we have done in Lima, 24 hours because earlier my officers told me, sir, you can visit the conference hall for one hour a day or sometimes when you are intervention is there. I said that not, that's not my cup of tea. I'll come right at 9 a.m. when it starts and will go away when the deliberations are over. And I stayed all 10 days. I didn't see Lima. I didn't go Machu Picchu. I stayed back. And I interacted with all countries. We lobbied all countries and created a LNDC more strong, like-minded parties. Because this is needed. We are, we are positive, we are proactive, we are doing on our own. Big things. 100 gigawatts of solar power. The earlier plan was 20,000 megawatts, which you heard of many times. But 20,000 megawatt never scaled up to 30,000 or 35,000. That's not limitation. That's not ambition for Narendra Modi. He said 1 lakh megawatt. And how will you do it? I said convert this into investment. It is 100 billion dollars of investment. I told world that you are talking of 100 billion green climate fund which you will be creating and which you are not creating. So that's what you are just discussing. We are already into it. We will build up 100 billion invest, 100 billion dollar investment to create this 100 gigawatt in next five years. How we will do it? We have the plan ready. We have the roadmap ready. And what it will happen? It will save 135 million tons of coal saved, coal unburned. It's 145 million tons of emissions saved. That's my contribution. That's our contribution to the world. And that's what we will be going to do. So, we are doing it all. But he knows very clearly that in Lima, there was an effort, a concerted effort, that all intended nationally determined contributions would be about only mitigation. We forced, and everybody had to accept, 
that it will be around adaptation. And the final result or the decision sheet which we will see has said very clearly the Paris, the Paris agreement which is going to happen in December 2015 will have based on and it will have it will be under the mention and with all the principles of equity, CBDR and RC respected capacities and will include it will address all uh, that is ad mitigation, adaptation, finance, technology, capacity building, everything. So this means of implementation is our important thing. And we fought battle not for us. We fought battle for all these developed countries, for all island countries, for all uh, developing world. And that's what we should go out of. I'll just uh, mention few skills. You said rightly that Manarika, MNRGA, can have. And today there was a very good discussion in Boksa. Sometimes we, what we read in newspapers don't believe everything because they give the headlines of what has not happened. <laughs> but they really don't give what has really gone well. Because that is not news. I am not sure what I am doing. So, what is the news? I am not sure what I am doing. So, what is the news? So, that is how it is. That's how it happens. <laughs> so, MNRGM, many people say that we must include the portion of funds, a portion, some portion of funds for adaptation measures, for climate change measures. And we have already said that under the forestry sector, based on principles of Go Green policy, our government has decided to plant trees under MNRG. Yes, that's a good beginning. And I think this is how we must go ahead. We have already taken a decision of CAMPA. <coughs> Can you believe that 12 years, because of some court chakra, 36,000 crores are deposited in my kitty. They are the CAMPA funds. They are made for afforestation. In 12 years, these trees would have gone and tremendous carbon sink would have happened. But it has not happened because of just negligence. I have done away with this. Now we have come up with a good plan, the whole scheme and guidelines, and we are submitted to the Supreme Court. And I am very sure that next month we will get the nod and we will distribute 33,000 crores to the states with explicit condition that this is not replacement of your budget, this is additionality for creating the carbon sink. That is how we want to go ahead. That's what we want. <laughs> there is agriculture, you told many things, as water, Namami Ganga is just the beginning. But we'll go ahead with many more uh, uh, challenges. We have already taken the national food grid, uh, the national disaster response force, which is now, they hope we should not be always negative. Ha, tsunami ki chabis tari ko anniversary hai. I have sent video message for that today. Kyoki Swami Nathan ji se bhi baat hui, lekin pandit chari bahut ek dur jagai, us din class ta program ha, lekin it's an important event. We were shocked, taken aback by the flurry of the, those uh, tsunami. But now we have learned in Orissa, in Hudud, in Orissa and in Andhra, we could save lives by three simple things. We give alert in time, we shift the population from the risk area, then we cut the trees, uh, branches facing the seas, or whatever scientifically is required, and we just disconnect or we put power off. With that one or three, four steps, we could save lives and property, because then there are no fires. So we are learning, we are adapting, and we will learn more. <coughs> National Water Mission, Make in India, Bank Account for Everybody, National Action Plan, of which you made some criticism, I will take note of that, and the state action plans is all about adaptation and resilient climate change uh, governance. 
So all this put together, I am really happy that the nation has started thinking about it. And I am very happy that young generation which is here, they are more sensitive. They are more sensible. The Environment Ministry building, which is the new Parayamanan in Jorbar, is, we have made it open to the public. I want people to be more sensitive about it. So every day 500 students are coming. Yes, from last month I have started it. On Nehru Jayanti, I started it uh, with school children. Now architect college students are also coming. They must learn. And I tell them very clearly that this building I have not brought up. One thing is very clear. I want to show because that's the new building. And I was very happy today to learn that more than 8,000 such buildings are already in India. India, everything what happens in India is large number. Because we have large number. <laughs> So, 8,000 buildings, and somebody was telling me nearly 30 million, or no more than 300 million uh, square foot of area is already under, uh, is already built up, which is eco friendly, energy positive. Or, and if you come to my office, I invite you all, we will not only energy positive, if you come, you will have vibes of positive energy also. <laughs> <laughs> so, with that I really commend this book. All will read.